So our recent study found that as people get older through younger, middle, and older adulthood, they tend to be more lonely in younger adulthood and more lonely in older adulthood, but become less lonely in middle age and then become lonely in older adulthood. Okay. So, so it's a U-shaped curve, yes. Okay. Uh, there are many uh, expectations of people in midlife that um, they're, you know, running around taking care of children, taking care of their own aging parents with mm -hmm. careers and that sort of thing. So there's lots of opportunities for connection and responsibility that, you know, maybe they don't have time to be lonely. <laughs> so our findings actually found that people, that a lot of factors are related to being persistently lonely, but not necessarily becoming lonely. Okay. So individuals who have less points of social contact are less educated, uh, are divorced or widowed, those people tend to be more persistently lonely. Or, and finding ways that are meaningful for that person, like um, scheduling FaceTime calls, just meeting up at a park or mm -hmm. going out for a coffee, that sort of thing.